So today we're gonna watch some TikToks. In my research for this video, I found that cycling TikToks fall in one of either two categories, boring or misogynist. Hopefully today's TikToks will be neither of those things, but let's just jump in and get started. Whoever's getting cuddles tonight, I hope you fall off your bed. Is the bike Whoever's in the bed? getting cuddles tonight, I hope you fall off your bed. Okay, real talk. We've all thought about doing this. I'm not above admitting it. Yeah. No. Okay. Yeah. Okay. No. I've done that before. Yeah. That's good. No. Oh, I've done that before too, a lot. Yeah. I've done all of these bad things. I think that I have terrible cycling skills. Sometimes you just need to lean on the handlebars after a really long ride or during a really long ride because you're tired. Okay, it's about to start over. Okay, that's really impressive. I can't do that on the trainer. She making, oh my God. She is making a sandwich on the trainer. Oh my god, that's so impressive! Wow. 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 Also, let me just say that putting the trainer thing next to your kitchen counter so that you can eat, wow. Wow. Absolutely brilliant. 10 out of 10. I'm gonna try that at some point. Okay. Oh, that's badass. Oh, sweet, I wouldn't do that. Yes, I'm a girl, but I like this. What does that even mean? No. Okay, this is problematic in a lot of ways, but it makes me feel really sad for this person that she, and I'm assuming that her pronouns are she, her, that she has to make some kind of caveat to say, I'm a badass bitch and I like to mountain bike and do really cool mountain bike things because that's awesome. I can't do what, what this person is doing. Ugh. Stuff like this makes me rage. Stuff like this makes me rage, I swear to God. Okay, next one. Ooh, another mountain bike video. Ooh. Ooh, that's really cool. Oh my God, my hands and feet are sweating. I don't do heights very well. Ooh. Oh, that's really cool. Wow, that's beautiful. I don't know where this is. Oh, I think it's German, Germain? No, I don't know where this is. This is really cool. That's really beautiful. I don't know about you guys, but I love watching POV cycling videos. <laughs> I love watching people who strap the chest harness on them uh, on their chest and like just go ride really difficult courses. I think it's so much fun to watch, um, especially with the new GoPros and the stabilization is just really off the charts. They're so satisfying. Do you guys like that? Let me know in the comments if you if if I'm am I the only one who watches those? All right, next one. All right, stretching, stretching gay. Ooh, oh my god. This is a thirst trap video and I am here for it. Wow. Wow. Cycling thirst traps. Wow. Amazing. Okay, this one was really short. All right, next. All right, Berlin. This is why Berlin is an amazing, amazing city, city for cyclists. We have chaotic oh, disorienting bike lanes. Sometimes there are trees okay. in the middle of a bike lane. Sometimes there okay. are cars. Sometimes you don't know which one is the bike lane. We have construction sites that make you ride on the sidewalk or put a crazy twist this or turn This is the most European there. problem. It's always I swear an adventure. To God. Sometimes the bike lane is on the street. Sometimes it's next to the street. Sometimes it's green. Sometimes it's red. Sometimes it's black or even old as fuck asphalt. At least you have sometimes a bike it's red lane. and old as fuck asphalt. Sometimes the bike oh, lane just disappears yeah, like, altogether. Welcome, welcome <laughs> Where to does the it struggle. go? In Berlin, we also have half-destroyed bikes just oh, left no. right on the side of the street. It's basically just one big free open-air museum dedicated to all those mutilated yeah. bikes out there. It's always a friendly reminder that all good things must come to okay. an end. We also have magic bikes. Just lean your bike up against anything. Look the other way for a moment. Oh, well, and that's boom, why you should lock gone. up your bike, bro. This is why Berlin is an amazing city for. 
oh my god why don't you come cycle in Atlanta for a little while? Now, I will say that the path is awesome. There are some bike lanes here. You're mostly just gonna have to battle the cars and fi like figure out which roads are like safer to go on. I've only had one really close call in Atlanta when I was commuting to work and someone tried to run me off the road. And I was in a bike lane when that happened but that's the only time I've ever had any real issues here. But anyway, complaining about the state of your bike lanes, when you have an extensive system of bike lanes, I'm sorry, I have no sympathy for you. And you have universal healthcare, so like, please, please. Why do I have the word bike oh my. really big Ooh. on my steering wheel? Just a little reminder for myself. I may or may not oh have God. previously <laughs> driven under a low bridge with bikes oh, so on my car. Bikes oh my God. Car. Why do I have the oh, word bike baby. really big on my steering wheel? Just oh my god, I will say this is my worst fear. I recently just got a roof rack for my mountain bike and I am so afraid of destroying my bike and my car by driving under a bridge or like going through a drive through and then forgetting that it's on the roof and then like hitting the sign. Oh my god, this is real. This is real. I'm so sorry that she experienced that. Wow. <sighs> All right, next one. Protecting hairstyles, does that mean, okay. Okay. I can't do that with my hair. I have too much hair. That's not gonna work for me. Okay, I'm gonna watch this again. Um, water drop, okay. My hair does not look like that when I put it in a bun. I have so much hair. I, I wish that I could pull that off. I mean, the truth, the truth of it is, is that we all look kind of stupid in a helmet. But if you can make this work for you, I, wow, I really applaud you. Wow. Oh yeah. I don't think those booties actually work. They've never worked for me. Uh oh, oh, oh my God. Oh my God, this struggle is real. Why, why we can't figure out a system for uh, women's bibs so that it is, makes it really easy to pee and you don't have to completely undress in order to go to the bathroom. Like, I think there's like one company, I think Velocio has bibs that you can just, there's like a flap or something. I might be wrong about this. This needs to be standard in all bibs. Like, come on cycling companies, like this is a, this is a problem. <laughs> All right guys, these are all the TikToks that I have for today. If you like this content and wanna see more of it, please let me know in the comments below. Also, if you like this video, please hit the like button and subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you next time.